It's time for 12 Talk, and next week we got the opportunity to taste some fresh seafood all the way from Maine. It's the River Region Lobster Fest. This is Candace Frazier, the Church of the Ascension pastor, along with Katie Richard. Thanks so much for being here. Fill us in on the Lobster Fest, exactly what it is and how it works. Well, we are so excited about the Lobster Fest, and we are so thankful for y'all and allowing us to come and talk about it today. This is our fifth year to do the River Region Lobster Fest at the Church of the Ascension. We've done it uh, as a fundraiser for our Ascension Day School as well as respite at First United Methodist Church. So all of our proceeds are split between these two fantastic organizations serving our youngest and our oldest in society. I love you guys look great. You're ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> this is the fifth year. Katie, talk a little bit about how it's evolved and developed and become such a popular event. Yeah. Well, I might take that from Katie. Yes. <laughs> Katie's going to talk a little bit about the day school, but uh, it has been a fun event. And Katie and I were actually just talking about that um, because this year we are actually including nursery care as well for any of those who want to come. We have two dine-in seating times at 6 and at 7. And you come in about 30 minutes before your seating. You have a little cocktail party. Then you go down and sit in Ascension Hall and you are served your lobsters and sides and desserts. Uh, it's a lot of fun. We have a band, uh, Coleman Woodson and Friends, who plays during the Lobster Fest. And so as I said, this year we're adding uh, nursery care as well. So families can come and take advantage, have a night out. Maybe supper clubs come and join us. Uh, table seat 10 people and you can let us know that you want to sit with particular people and we will set that seating assignment for you so you can come hang out with your friends and just have a great night out on the town. Yeah, that's so fun and so great that you include children this year. I see those little faces. I'd love to run through that area. I see yeah. those little faces being dropped off so early in the morning. <laughs> Tell us about your day school and who it serves. Yes, of course. Um, it's like you said, um, you see the beautiful uh, school and the garden district. Um, we serve ages 10 weeks to five years. Um, I believe we have around 115 children right now. Um, and you know, the mission of the school is really to provide a safe and nurturing learning environment where children can grow academically, spiritually, and socially, um, and every child there, um, you know, we want them to know that they are a child of God and feel loved and included. And I can say as a parent and a board member that um, we definitely feel that sense of inclusion. We want every parent and child to feel that way. Um, and we just have such great teachers and staff and an excellent director um, and an excellent church behind us. So we're all very lucky. Um, to be there. Real quick before we go, is there a deadline? Do we need to sign up? Yes, by certain... the deadline is Sunday. So Sunday, so the time is ticking. Fest, time is ticking. Order those tickets, $50 next Friday night, August 18th. It is going to be so much fun. It's going to be the best event in Montgomery next weekend, so you definitely want to be there. Thank you, ladies.